Orioles hosting the Yankees, and the Yankees are plus 132 on the money line. The Orioles are minus 156. The over-under is 8.5 runs. The Yankees getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 166, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. And the Orioles laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 138, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two or more. They've played each other twice so far this year, and the Orioles have won both games. The first one, 2 nothing, and then the game today, 4-2. to now, Gill did not pitch against the Orioles last year or this year. Burns did pitch against the Yankees as a member of the Brewers. Eight shutout innings, they lost that game 4-3 to three in 13 innings, and he struck out seven, and that was at Yankee Stadium. Now, as far as the weather is concerned for tomorrow's game, it is supposed to be 80 degrees with 7-mile-an-hour winds and a 4% chance of rain. And if Burns was pitching against any other team not named the Yankees or Dodgers, and we'll toss the Braves in there for good measure, he would not be minus 152. He'd probably be about 250, especially being that the team won the previous two games. Now, head-to-head, -head, the Orioles are on a three-game winning streak. The Orioles are 7-3. and three. The home team's won the last three games. The home team is 6-4. and four. The underdog is 6-4 and four on the money line. The underdog getting a run and a half on the run line is 6-4, and four, mainly because it's been the Orioles. There have been one one-run game in their last 10. The under is hitting their last two. The over is 5-4-1, and one, and the over 8.5 is 6-4. and four. The Yankees are 5-5 five and five in their last 10, and the over-under is 5-5 five and five in their last 10. They're on a two-game losing streak. It's amazing how they could put up 15 runs in back-to-back -back games against the Brewers, and then they muster two runs total in two games against the Orioles. Just the level of competition. There was 18 runs, 20 runs, 2 runs, and 6 runs. 15 runs and a win, 15 runs and a win, shut out and a loss, 2 runs and a loss. For the Orioles, they're 7-3 and three in their last 10, 3-1 and one in their last 4. 7 runs, 13 runs, 2 runs, 6 runs. 7 runs and a win, 6 runs and a loss, 2 runs and a win, 4 runs and a win. And to think that I'm going to take Gill over a Cy Young pitcher at home, not going to happen. Orioles with the money line, Orioles laying the runs, and the under. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.